Hello, welcome back to the Happy Hut. Does the Boya BY-M1 work with the Sony ZV-1 camera or ZV-1 if you're from somewhere like me? And the answer is yes, it does because I've got two of them and the other one is plugged into the Sony ZV-1 right now. You're actually listening to the Boya BY-M1 clip on the Valier lapel microphone. I absolutely love this microphone. I've used it on my GoPro Hero. I've used it with my Osmo Pocket. I'm just trying it out now so that you can hear exactly how this microphone sounds with the Sony ZV-1. Now I don't have a, a windshield on it. So I've got the normal kind of pop shield on it but I don't have one of those big furry windshields I'll be doing a, an external an outdoors what's external I'll be doing an outdoors test audio test with the Boya BY-M1 plugged into the Sony ZV-1 in just a minute there's time codes in the description to guide you through all of this I'm just basically trying to do as much talking as possible so that you get to hear how this microphone sounds what do you think it's about four o'clock here in the UK, so you can hear a lot of traffic in the distance, hopefully. Maybe I should be quiet for a moment so you get to hear how the microphone sounds when it's not picking up any fantastic things that I'm saying. In this video, I'm going to compare how this sounds outdoors against the Sony ZV-1 camera's inbuilt microphone. Then after that, we're going to go indoors into the Happy Hearts, which is quite a challenging audio environment, and you'll get to hear what it sounds like indoors. And then we'll go for a proper walk. We'll do some vlogging, some walking and talking with the Boya BY-M1, so you get to see what it's like with a big furry mini dead cat windshield on uh, just in case there's some light wind now affecting how this is sounding. This is how the Sony ZV-1 camera or ZV-1 camera sounds with the inbuilt microphone or built-in microphone. I don't think anyone's quite agreed on that yet but I'm going to do some talking so you can compare how this sounds with the Boya BY-M1 which isn't plugged in right now. You might be able to hear in the background I've got some kids on a trampoline and some traffic noise as people go home and it looks like maybe a few raindrops as well so I'll keep talking so you can compare the inbuilt microphone with the Boya BY, I don't know why I'm still holding this. <laughs> this is how the Boya BY M1 clip on Lavalier mic sounds compared to the inbuilt microphone. For the Sony ZV1, I can't say it still, the Sony ZV1 or ZV1 camera built in microphone. This is how it sounds. And now we're back on with the Boya BY-M1 plugged into my Sony ZV-1 camera, or is it ZV-1 camera? I'll show you later on also the audio level settings that I've had to change in the camera itself. I set the camera to around 11 for plugging the Boya BY-M1. And as you know yourself, if you have a Sony ZV-1 camera, the audio setting tends to be around the 25, 26 level for the inbuilt microphone. I have to bring it right the way down for this microphone. Oh, I don't need to show it to you later. That's it right there. <laughs> How does this compare with the Boya BY-M1? Leave a comment, or if you have no opinion, just say hi, it'd be great to hear from you. One more time with the Boya BY-M1 lapel microphone, external microphone plugged into my Sony ZV-1 camera. And back to the internal microphone on the Sony ZV-1 camera. We'll do a proper walk and talk in a minute, but it's getting a little bit cold. So let's, let's go inside now to the happy heart to see or, or hear <laughs> how the Boya BY-M1 sounds indoors. I'm actually inside the Happy Heart. Hello, <laughs> welcome to the Happy Hearts. It's not a very forgiving place for audio in here. There are lots of hard surfaces, but I'm still doing my best to do as much talking as possible so you get a sense of how this microphone sounds with the Sony ZV-1 camera or the ZV-1 digital camera. Let's compare it now to the inbuilt microphone or is it built-in microphone? This now is how the Sony, I keep saying Zony, the Sony ZV-1 or ZV-1 camera sounds with the built-in microphone. And this is how the BY-M1 microphone sounds indoors again. I'll give the mic a gentle tap. 
This is how the built-in microphone sounds indoors in the happy hearts with a lot of hard surfaces. This is the Boya BY-M1 external microphone on the Sony ZV-1 or ZV-1. I'm going to be quiet now just to see what it sounds like. I can't even say the <laughs> sentence. I'm going to be quiet for a few seconds so you can hear the ambient noise and any other noise that might be picked up by this microphone. I'm going to be quiet for a few seconds just so you can hear any other noise on the recording. And back again on the Boya BY-M1. And this is how the built-in microphone sounds. What I'm going to do now is head off outside and see how this sounds in outdoor conditions. I've put this Comica dead cat or, or mini dead cat or dead kitten windshield onto my Boya BY-M1 just so you can see what it's like in a sort of a walking vlogging situation. I much prefer using the Boya to uh, having some kind of shotgun microphone. I find it a little bit more discreet, even though there's a cable <laughs> attached between me and the, the camera. Maybe now's a good time to talk through some of the, the upsides, the things I love about the Boya BYM1 and some of the downsides. I actually really like the long cable. Some reviews have said that it's a, it's a bit annoying having so much cable. I, I don't find it annoying at all. I really need it. And I've used the Boya BYM1 in some interview situations where I've plugged two microphones into a splitter cable. You can't really get away from it, but there is a battery, a very small battery. I've no idea when it runs out and it is a bit fiddly to fit, but having a battery is a little bit annoying. I have given myself a little mnemonic device just to remind myself not to leave it on. It seems to work. I do seem to turn it off, so, so that's helpful. I'm going to take this off now because this is the Sony ZV-1 camera internal microphone, the built-in microphone or the inbuilt microphone, whichever you prefer. I've got it all caught up in my thing. There we go. You can hear some irresponsible motorcyclists in the background probably. I'm going to try and keep talking so that you get a sense of how the internal microphone sounds compared to the Boya BYN1 but maybe now's a good time for us to cut back to... Oh, there's another thing that's, that comes up a lot. Every time I've reviewed the Boya BYM1, there's always a comment that says, but the connector, the connector Neil, it's a TRRS. Surely that's for phones. It's not going to work in a camera. Trust me, the Boya BYM1 absolutely works in a Sony ZV-1 camera. You're listening to it right now. The great thing we're doing these microphone reviews for the Sony ZV-1 camera is that I get a lot of exercise. So I'm just going to keep walking around uh, trying to avoid the dog walkers. And you probably noticed when I show you shots of the camera, I've got all kinds of things attached to it. I actually made a whole other video just about that. All my budget accessories, I'll put that link in the description and it might even be on screen now. You can click on the eye. And I've got quite a few more videos like this coming up. So you might want to hit the subscribe button down below. That would also help me enormously because I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. I have no idea if that's going to happen, but you could take me one step closer. And this is how the built-in microphone sounds. I'm going to go quiet for a moment just so you get a sense of how the ambient noise sounds outdoors. Uh, maybe I'll be quiet for a moment so you can hear some ambient noise. We've got a major road in that direction and a major playground in that direction. I'll just give you some silence so you can hear ambient noise while I'm walking. I think I'm going to get photobombed by a jogger. And now back to the Sony ZV-1 built-in microphone. Also in the description, I've put links to the microphone itself and also to this Comica mini dead cat, dead kitten windshield. I just leave it on all the time. And how are you finding the sound of the Boya BYM1? What do you think? Is this something that you might like to buy? Do, would you prefer to have like a shotgun microphone on the top of your Sony ZV-1? Leave a comment below. This is how the built-in microphone sounds outdoors while walking on the not on the, but with the Sony ZV-1 camera. 
right here is what YouTube thinks you should be watching next. Just, just as the helicopter goes over. <laughs> I take it you can hear the helicopter, right? 